Okay, so I'm on the bfunky.com screen, and I'm going to upload a new image that I want to prop. So um, I'm going to upload it from my computer. I'm going to find an image for Ellicott. Okay, so let's say I'm uploading an image that's, this image is 1600 pixels by 735 pixels. But I wanna use it on the portfolio section, which as I mentioned is, oh, let me double check the size. needs to be 502 pixels by 376. So I want to change the um, either the width or the height. So the one that's going to need to be maintained is the, the larger, um, well, it needs to be at at a minimum of 376 pixels here. So if I change the width to 502, it, my height is not gonna be enough. So I need to change that to 376. And now my width is 819 and that's okay. So then I'm gonna click apply. Then I'm going to click crop. So once I'm on this screen, I need to drag the box to the full height, I mean full width because it automatically shrinks that box a little bit. And then I'm going to change this width here to 502. Okay, and now it has applied a crop to that. Let me go back, actually. If I need to undo anything, I just push this undo button. I'm gonna go to crop, and I'm gonna type in 502, oops. I'm going to resize this first, and I'm going to say 502. And then if I don't click that checkbox right away, it allows me to drag where I want to crop this image. So let's say I want to show like this entire dredge here. So I'm going to drag it over there. Then I'm going to click apply. Now I've applied the crop where I want it to be. And now if I go back to click resize, this image is 502 by 376. And that is the... Um, image size that I want. So now I can just click save um, to my computer, save file to computer, change your file name. If you want to save it as a JPEG, that's fine. The quality is 98, that's fine. And then click save. And um, once you have that, you'll be able to upload that into the portfolio section of the website.